What's up guys, it's iAppleTech, and today I'm going to show you how to install a dev file using Cydia. Now, this procedure does not require the use of terminal or mobile terminal because we are doing this via SSHing into our, our device, and this works for all Apple devices as well, and you must be jailbroken uh, because we will have to install OpenSSH on our device via Cydia. So first, you want to go ahead and open up a... SSH program. I'm using Cyberduck. I'll have links below. Or if you're on Windows, you can go ahead and use Open SCP or another similar program like that. You also want to have your dev file right here. So this is a Cydia tweak right here, just for uh, demonstration purposes only. So go ahead and open up your program. I'm using Cyberduck. And then go ahead and uh, click on Open Connections. And you want to go ahead and change this option right here to SFTP, SSH File Transfer Protocol. And the server is going to be your IP address on your device. If you go into your settings on your device, then you want to go ahead and click on Wi Fi and then click on the blue arrow next to your Wi Fi name and you'll see your IP address right there. This is what you want to enter for the server. So then you want to go ahead and open up Cydia on your device and go ahead and search for the application OpenSSH. Right there. So this package will allow us to securely remote access between our device and our computer. So then just go ahead and then download that. So using that IP from my device, I'm going to go ahead and type it in. And then once I've done typed it in, the default username is going to be root and the default password is Alpine, A-L-P-I-N-E. I'll have those in the description below. And you want to keep the port the same and make sure it is SFTP. And then go ahead and make sure your device is on and it is not locked. And then go ahead and click Connect. And now we are into the root directory of our device. So once we're in it, we want to go into our var root media. And if you're not on this, you can always go ahead and click on the slash mark and then go under var root and then media. And if you're a first time user, which most of you will be, you will not have a city of folder here. So you just want to go ahead and right click and select new folder and then type out city and, and then select create then double click into Cydia and you will not have anything here so you want to right click and you want to add a new folder and call this auto install just as I have there then into auto install you want to go ahead and double click that and this is where you're going to take your dev file right there and go ahead and drag it into the auto install folder right here and at this time make sure your device is on as well and it will be transferring the deb onto our device so let me bring you over to the device now then you want to go ahead and reboot your device so that the tweak does come in effect after we moved it over so then once your device has resprung just go ahead and slide to unlock and if you go into your settings, the tweak that you just installed should be there. Right there it is. You can see we installed the I Caught You Pro right there. Go ahead and click on it and it is fully functional. So this works for both uh, paid uh, tweaks and free tweaks. So if Cydia is acting up and you are able to get the deb file for the tweak, you can go ahead and SSH the file into your device without any hassle at all. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, leave your comments in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks.